Okay, so talk us a bit about your your volleyball uh, career that you had before track and mm -hmm. field. Like, was it quite competitive? Was it just a, a pastime? Like, can you talk us through that oh. a little? It was competitive. You know, we would have games. Um, my school would go against, would rival against other schools, and sometimes on the weekends, my family, my friends, my cousins, we all would play volleyball. We had a court where we live, so we all would play home as well. Yeah, almost every every weekend I would play. And then talk us through that transition from volleyball to track and field. Like, what was it that started that? Um, was it something you were thinking about, or was it someone said to you, you really should try this? Um, I was thinking about it. I competed one year um, at Bahamas Junior Champs. I didn't do so good, but I stayed with everybody. I, com I kept up with everybody in the race. So the next year, I thought about just trying track and field, and I wanted to be a sprinter, but my high school coach, he said I'm too tall, so he would try me in a quarter, and here I am in the 400, <laughs> stuck. And what kind of time were you running when you first started? Uh, my first 400 was 50.01. It hurt, but then like a month later, I ran 48. <laughs> cool. So talk us through those first few months. Like, what was it like doing all that training, coming from a volleyball background? Uh, it was hard. Um, we have we would have a lot of 450s to do, and I hated them. I only could do one. We had like five. I only had, could do one. But I would throw up every time. But he always would put me to the side and he just let me be finished for the day because I was done. Ah, uh, yeah, the race is pretty good. You know, my coach, we talked together about our race, our race model and I executed it. But, you know, it's all good. I felt really good during the race. But, you know, after, everybody who knows me know that I would collapse, but I stayed strong. <laughs> I kind of like to have fun, but then still work hard because it's a job and if you don't like your job, you're not going to perform well. So I, I would be the joker of the group. <laughs> so I, I saw you uh, in Doha in the, in the time between Shanghai and Doha, mm -hmm. and you were kind of there with your headphones on, dancing around a little bit. <laughs> oh yeah, um, that's just to get me in the mood for competing or for practice. I know this music every day before I go on to practice. So training. you and Noah Lyle's gonna have a dance off at some point? Uh, I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> um, I like rap music, you know, rap and pop music, my favorite. So have you got a favorite artist? Um, Rihanna, uh, Nicki Minaj, I'm um, Jay-Z, yeah. Cool. 